Hello Mac Warriors, how's it going? And welcome to your daily dose of Mac Warrior Online. Today guys, it is time to play the Timberwolf. It's a classic, it's a beautiful mech, it is really hard to play, it is big, it is boxy, it has low slung arms, and I wouldn't say that this is a good beginner mech, but anyway, I'm gonna take it today because I just like, like the aesthetics, I haven't played a Timberwolf in a, in a while, and as you can see, we are running some energy weapons today. We have the laser rack on the left shoulder, which is really good for peeking at the same time. Keep in mind guys, that thing is big, that thing is obvious, and if if you lose the left side torso, you lose a lot of your firepower. So play this mech as a second liner, play this mech as a damage dealer, and then have a good time. Don't try to push anything. Again, it's a big obvious target, and the side torsos are massive on that thing. And if you lose them, you basically lose a lot of your firepower. Now, we're gonna take the Timberwolf C variant today, because it also has an energy hardpoint in the nose. But you can just use any Timberwolf and just mix and match the Omnipods so that you have enough energy hardpoints to make use of that. So if you don't have the C, take a Prime or whatever and put the medium laser on the left arm. Again, it's a bit low slung, but you can still do things with it. Uh, on top of it, we have our laser array on the left shoulder, as I was saying, and since it's the high mount, it's the peaking mount, uh, our most impactful weapons are sitting there, so we can use them to peak and, and deal some early damage at range. And the large pulse lasers here are actually quite good. We have a pair of them, so we have two, as well as an ER medium laser, and I think the, the range of the large pulse and the ER medium align quite nicely, so we have 600 meters optimal range here, which is actually quite good. And then we have the 400 and uh, 40 optimal range here coming from the ER medium laser. So our optimal fighting distance is at about 500 meters. And uh, again, we want to poke the enemy, then we want to fall back, we want to cool down, and we want to go in and out. So it's kind of like a vertical peaking mech that we are playing here. Problem is, of course, a bunch of our lasers on the right side are rather low slung. So we have, when you take a look at that, we have two of the lasers here in that arm, and you really have to expose your mech quite a lot if you want to bring them on point. So sometimes it's good to peak vertically and then try to poke around the right side and in order to follow up with the damage from the nose weapons and the you know the arm weapons. So again, you you should play it more defensively than offensively. And if in doubt, then just shoot your high rack and just play it carefully. Uh, on top of it, as you can see, the rest of the mech is just heat management. We have the um, Timberwolf S right torso that also gives us two jump jets. It's quite nice to have that in order to get over obstacles or to get into a high ground situation on something like Canyon Network or Hibernal Rift. And um, yeah, it's it's nice to have. And that's a Timberwolf, guys. Let's talk about the skills here. As you can see, I have put everything into the firepower tree that has to do with range, cooldown, laser duration, and heat gen. Heat gen is the most important thing that you can get here because it'll help you shoot more often because your lasers won't build so much heat anymore. That's kind of a no-brainer, right? That makes sense. So your limiting factor here is basically uh, your armor of course, because you want to stay alive, and then your heat management. And uh, again, laser duration helps you uh, lowering the laser duration so that your peaks are not that long and you can play it a bit safer. We also have a bit of survivability and you might be like, wait, did you not say that this mech is squishy and did you don't want to get shot and stuff like that? And that's the exact point. I don't want to get shot, so this is not a brawler that wants to expose itself. I just have some armor points here which were leftovers. I consider this a damage dealer and not a tank, therefore positioning is my defense here. Um, on top of that, we got maximum cool run again, so we can fire as often as possible. We also have maximum heat containment for the same reason. We got rated deprivation for some nice uh, lock breaking mechanisms here. So that's good. If somebody locks onto you and you are exposing yourself, you gotta wait for your laser duration to go uh, and finish. And then uh, the missiles are already flying, then you pull back uh, in cover, the missiles will lose track and they will hit the ground. That's why laser, sorry, radar deprivation is so important here. We also got a double cool shot plus a UAV, and that is the build, everybody. I wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming now, and if you have that, as always, don't forget to leave a rating, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I hope to see the battlefield now. Alrighty, first game of the day. We are playing the Caustic Valley. We are playing Domination. It's a pretty toasty map and we decided to go to the left because this is where the Assault Mechs spawn. We don't want to leave them alone and we want to try to get some damage on our enemies that are running around the, the circle, trying to get in our fa flanks fast and we're gonna just kill them and then the rest of the team, of the enemy team, will arrive. Hopefully. Let's see. So, we're gonna wait here. Our little oh, guy. No hey, bird. Our little guy has ECM, so I'm gonna try to Watch get close here, to him yeah. so I can benefit from it as well. And and we're gonna try to get somewhat... Wait, wait, wait. Was that Cinder or was we that a UAV? Um, interesting, there's a guy. And we missed him. All right, so he was behind the thing. He was behind the rock there, which is okay. But we know that our enemies are coming in now. Hello, Orion2C, what about you, buddy? So we got some damage on the Orion. Get the Orion as fast as possible. Okay, 
Maybe I should go for night vision because that really helps targeting. Also, the heat is gonna be a problem. So I should really make sure that I'm hitting my stuff. Yo, Assault Max, left side, don't rotate, please. Hold the left side. All right, we're gonna poke that. Why are you saying negative? This is such a good spot here. Come on, guys, really? We can peek that, that's good. Um, careful with the, with the peeking, though, because... Oh, that's good. That was great. That was good damage. King Crab, don't push. Oh, no. Just hold it. We just need to hold it. Don't push in. All right, let's go for that guy. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. So far, I'm managing my heat by just using the pulses. There's another dude. Yeah, this is not great, guys. This is not good at all. There's a guy. Let me try to... Hit him! Got some damage in. And I think we're just gonna take it slow, and then we're gonna win this game. So, hot. I am hot as hell. Alright, people are trying to get to the center. People don't trust each other, that's a problem. We could really hold this line here if we just do it together. That's the important part about it. And if we give each other a little bit of room to breathe, that's also very much important. Alright, gonna try to back up from this because missiles will fly. Papa, you will be here. And we're gonna push forward, get that arctic wolf. Yeah, those guys are trying to get on us. Cannot shoot the right side of my weapons, so here we go. Um, hmm. So far, so good. Ish. Ish, I say. Here we go. Let's go for the Warhammer. Oh, that's beautiful. Nice. We got some great damage in there. I'm gonna pop my cool shot here because I will fire at the Warhammer a bunch of times from this point. Can I hit him? I don't know. I don't know. Again, we're gonna take it slow. I don't like this Warhammer's position there, but now the rotation is on. Yeah, you can see it. It's really... Oh, what? I don't want the battle map. No. There's a Warhammer in Delta 6. He will be in our back, so be careful with the rotation, guys. Um, just be aware. That's what I want to say here. Let's get the Trebuchet. Trebuchet is one shot. Foxtrot in the back. Kill him, please. If you can. All right, the Arctic Wolf. Let's go for the Wolf, then. Is he still here? Ah, uh, he is. Let's get him. Oh, wait. Not a kill? But you know what? He's fine. Oh, we are fine. He is a summoner. The summoner is not really what I want here. Also, I pushed out too far. Let's uh, let's get back into the team cohesion. Where's my Frogstrot friend? He's there. So we're gonna try to kill that guy. All right, he's dead. Perfect. So that's lots of SRMs. I don't like that either. Ah, all right, four and one. I mean, it's looking good. Don't wanna don't wanna push that to the left. It's too dangerous. Oh, this guy's disconnected. Mm, that's a shame, man. That's a big shame. Sorry for that. We should probably not shoot him. There are other fish to fry. And we need to save our heat for the guys that actually are dangerous. Like this little dude here. So, we have quite hot. I don't like it. But let's go. We have something to kill still here on the right side. Left, right, whatever. Ah, uh, that's a bad shot. That was a lot of wasted heat. Um, and his streaks could potentially hurt us quite a lot. So, let's try to take him out as quickly as possible. Good. Overheating. Shutting down for a little bit of heat conversa conversation. Conservation. <laughs> Let's have a heat conversation here, guys. <laughs> so this guy's dead. That's good. Then we're gonna go back to the top because I want to get an overview. I think there are still some enemies in the caldera. So night vision for seeing through the smoke. There's the raven. Will you come up there, buddy? Please do it. Also, everybody wants to get that guy, obviously. So we're gonna try to find an angle. Let me see. That's a wolfhound, actually. It's not the raven. All right, good laser burn. I'm pretty happy with that one. And we're gonna try to cut his path, do the same thing again. And we are hot once more. It is the second right, to last we'll enemy. He's not quite the last. Oh, that was a bad sway. And the heat, the heat, the heat, the heat. All right, we cannot shoot. We can block him though. Or try. Be careful with the friendly fire. <laughs> so, arm weapons, lasers on the shoulder, and down he goes. Last guy was in Delta 4. I uh, just saw him there. And uh, as soon as we got that dude, we actually won the video game. So, let's see. Where did he go? Delta 4. There was somebody in Delta 4. Oh, there he is. All right, cool. It's a Vulcan. It's the Vulcan from the beginning. So, night vision yet again, so we can see through the freaking smoke. And we're gonna try to intercept him here. And that is God. him down. 
perfect. So yeah, we took a bit of damage here. We took a bit of overheat damage as well. But in general, that was a good fight. Even on a hot map like the Caustic Valley here, I think we performed quite well because we took our time, we engaged when we could, and uh, we were always riding our heat scale here. We got 809 damage out. Not too bad. We got two kill most damage dealt, 11 assists. We sadly didn't get a kill, but anyway, we took 270 and we got what? Two components destroyed. That's the first round, everybody. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. All right, second game of the day. We are playing the Frozen City Classic Knight. We have the horrible spawn, and we're gonna get up here and try to get down to Bravo 3 as quickly as possible, because enemies might be right in our face right here. So what we're gonna be doing is uh, we pop a UAV here, just to uh, tell our uh, friends that there are some enemies coming, as you can see. And um, yeah, then we're just gonna get the hell out of here, because those enemies will be in our backs in no time, and I don't want to get shot so early. So I'm gonna take this building as my cover. I think I can take it. Also, we have that UAV, which is basically a lizard's tail here. That means that um, if the enemies see that UAV, they will probably stop for a second or two and then try to take it down in order uh, to have a better life. And that, ooh, and that uh, you know, it gives us a bit of time to move and breathe. So yeah, it's just, just a decoy, basically. Now, I cannot peek there. <laughs> That's not possible. There's a lot of PPC stuff happening, but maybe we can peek around here... So nobody's on the high ground. There is a Victor right in front of us, but that's good because he wasn't aware of my position and we could get a full laser burn in his face. Rifleman 2C on the flank. Good to know. There's a UAV. I will quickly, quickly try to take that. Hello. So we got that. And there's another one. I think I really want to take those here. Come on. So we take it. He likes it. And let's not rotate too hard. Let's get to Charlie 4 and kill this Rifleman and then we're going to go from there. But don't go the long way around. Okay, Kid Fox. Oh, that hurt him. That hurt him big time. Or oh, we can hold left side, guys. You know what? Let's do that. Let's pull back a little and hold left side. That's the thing that we can do to actually win this. Yeah, like that. Uh, get the Arctic Wolf, guys. Come on, he overextended big time. On the dropship. On the dropship. Okay. That guy has to go quick, so we have our room to uh, maneuver again. And honestly, I want to get out of here. So... I'm attacking a little bit of fire, but this is where I want to be. I don't want to rotate any, anymore. That's the thing. I just want cover. And we have it here. So we're going to go back. Uh, on the catapult, guys, he overextended Alpha. Uh-huh. That is not good. They are really going for me. Catapult is cord, guys. Get him. It's Alpha. Okay. So can we peek that again? I hope so. I really hope so. I can peek that guy. It's a freaking atlas. Okay, I gotta be really careful with my center torso at this point. There's a shadow. You see the shadow? That means that there's an enemy. Uh, there's also smoke up there. Okay, let's... Ah, uh, it's way too late now. So, we're gonna hold this left side here. Guys on the left side, Bravo 3, there are people coming around. Bravo 3, it's hot. Okay, so... There is an Orion. Get the Orion, Charlie. So, heat is on. Orion is almost down, we can do it. Cool shot. Because we need that right now. Okay, we're gonna go for heavy PPC awesome. That left side. Get the left of the kilo awesome if you can. Because that cripples his heat management. I'm gonna try to get it. Come on! Hey, we got him. So that's all we need right now. That is a lot of damage off the board and a lot of heat management. Side torso here, same. I'm overheating. Oh, went to the arm. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> so again, my peaking spot. This is all I needed. I didn't want to rotate and I kept doing that. I mean, I kept, you know, holding on to my promise, I guess. That's what I want to say. So now it is time to kill the rest of the enemies. So where are they? That is not good. We wasted heat, but I think it's time to be aggressive now. There's a guy. Hello. Uh, okay, guys, let's just roll him. Let's go in and kill everybody. Mm, yeah, yeah, I don't like the, the, the lasers that are coming from the Nova there. Is he gonna do it again? I'm gonna wait for him. Oh, so much for that. Oh, leave me alone. Leave me alone, buddy. I gotta go. <laughs> that guy almost killed me, and now I'm dead, right? Am I? Oh, God. Where can I go to live? <laughs> Still alive. Still alive. Still alive. All right, so let's go, go in here again. There's an Atlas, which is almost dead. We can maybe help out here. Hey, we even got a kill. That's cool. And now we are on the flank of the rifleman and uh, whatever is left there. <laughs> we survived! So far, at the very least. And down they go. Beautifully done, guys. That was great.
that was so good so again listening to the calls not rotating staying out there taking cover yes but staying there and using that cover was beautiful we got a killing blow we got nine assists two kill mouse damage dealt with 733 damage done 320 taken and nine components destroyed and that was your daily dose for today everybody that was the timberwolf with a lot of lasers and i hope you enjoyed it and if you did then don't forget to leave a rating subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and i hope to see you guys tomorrow goodbye